Oh yeah. Let's open another box and let's use the new the new light. How's that working out for you? Oh yeah. Oh, I'm excited for that one. Made in China. Oh, look at these fancy, fancy packages. Packages of sealed air. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. So made in China. Made in China. This is going to be Exciting. Ah! Oh, look at that. What is it? I guess I better not break it. So what is it? It's a pistol grip. Pistol grip something. Very ergonomic. <laughs> this is a camera support mount Majangle and it's a little tiny little tiny tripod and you push this purple button here because it locks and you push this purple button to uh, move this you set her down like that and you put your camera on there and it's a little mini tripod and you can turn these around and you can put your camera on there and point it forward or point it backward or whatever whatever blows your hair back or you can turn it that way and point it backward or forward yeah so that's pretty neat let's try uh, this is a pretty small little camcorder so should have no problem Holding that. So you can do it backwards like that. And point it at yourself. And you can flip the screen around for selfie mode. Or you can turn 
the camera forward like that and shoot your shoot your shot what whatever blows your hair back or you can swing these out and push the purple button turn that up or down and you can set it in tripod mode it's a small tripod like for on top of a table or something so yeah it's pretty simple there was no name on the package but I'll do a screenshot of the name of that thing that little tripod but it's also it's also a pistol grip pistol grip camera support stabilizer whatever you want to call it and this is all adjustable for however you want to however you want to do and of course you can legit turn the turn the whole thing around that's probably what I would do I would probably turn it around backwards and then open this up into like a gun and use this as your gun handle and point your gun <laughs> that's pointing backwards right now but yeah you get the picture that'd be good for um, take this out and flip the screen around for selfie vlogs or whatever and that would certainly support whatever you can put a smartphone holder on here you can put a DSLR on here or digital camera or whatever. You could use that for your for your light or microphone. You could put a light or a microphone on here and just have it standing. So that's pretty cool. It's a nice little compact accessory for your camera bag. Boy, yeah. I just want to say booyah. Open sesame. Universal cardioid microphone model BYMM1. Uh, they have a M1 model. And this is the micro M1 or the smaller MM1. Here's some information and factoids for your brain. Compact on camera microphone compatible with smartphones, DSLR, consumer camcorders, PCs, rugged metal construction, no battery required, professional furry windshield included. Yeah. So I was looking for an external mic because the camera that I'm using right now has a external mic plug. See if I can get some better audio and pretend like try to get some better uh, quality stuff for you guys to watch. So I got this for you. Yeah, got this for you. So you can hear me better. Two wires. This one says smartphone. Smartphone. So it has a different plug on the end. This one has four connectors. 
and three dividers. It's a little different plug. It's the same size, but it's a little different for your smartphone. And this one here is for your camera, and it only has three connectors on each end and two dividers. So there's a name for these TRS and TRRS. I think this one is TRS, I'm not sure, but this one's the camera one. It's got a coily cord so it's not laying and hanging all over the place like an old school telephone cord y'all probably don't have any clue what that is but anyway there's a snack there for later for if you get hungry oh yeah Oh yeah. So we have a drawstring bag here. Keep your microphone out of the dust and uh, keep it wrapped up safe. Some sort of a pleather, plasticky, pretend leather. This is a anti-vibration mount, so it's flexible. I've heard, I've read reviews about this mic and a couple people actually broke theirs, broke their uh, their shock mount, like more than, like several people broke this, trying to put the microphone on it. So, I guess you'd want to be careful doing that. It seems like uh, they were aware that it was a common problem and I think they fixed it, I'm not sure. So that's the contents of the box. Specifications. Ooh, it's so soft and furry. Good kitty. Pet the furry walls. And this dead cat has a boya, a name tag. Seems like it's just spinning around in there. And of course, this comes off. It feels like there's some foam, some foam inside. This is the microphone itself. This is one part where a lot of people had problems with when I was checking the reviews. A lot of people like the audio quality, like it's loud and it's comparable to a uh, Rode Micro. So for the price it's a lot cheaper than a Rode Micro but it's comparable in every other aspect aside from the fact that it's more affordable or less expensive however you want to put that I can see how people would have a problem putting this on here and why they say there were so many problems because that is really tight wow but then again you don't want your microphone falling off and vibrating around too much so I guess they make it tight for a reason but there we go it's on and I didn't break it but if you seriously if you read the reviews the eBay and Amazon reviews on this thing so many people broke their shock mounts trying to put that on there <laughs> it's just a press on but it's tight and this is your shoe mount it's also threaded too so being threaded you could put it on uh, camera stud or this micro tripod let's try that just for the frig of it put that on there maybe I'll turn it around I'm pretty sure that the big has one big grip and two small two small legs so I'm pretty sure that most of the weight hangs over the big one like that it, it also has the uh, you can mount it upright or mount your camera vertical or horizontal whatever anywho you can see how that can mount on there but it also has a cold shoe or a shoe mount so you can put that into something like this up top 
and put your camera down below. So this one here is for the camera and they both have a 90 degree, both of these cables have a 90 degree end with uh, three connections. So the 90 degree end is clearly for the microphone itself. Plug that in there. I could set this down, but the cable is not long enough, so I'll just fold this back up again, and I'll just hold it. And I'm holding it about 16 inches down and out, away from, away from my face. And I think I'm going to plug it in, I think I'm going to plug it into you right now so just hang on tight there and we'll see what kind of a difference the audio makes I might shake you up here for a minute okay uh, the microphone is further away and I'm shaking it and I'm rattling it and it's, it's it's farther away than the camera is or the camera mic was so I'm standing directly behind the camera so my voice should have projected uh, closer into the camera microphone so I'll hold this closer to where the camera microphone is so I'm holding it on a bit of an angle right now but it's closer to where the a lot closer to where the original microphone is on the camera so for comparative reasons so you can compare the same location rather than holding a, a different microphone further away and also the projection so when you're standing behind behind the microphone or whether you're standing beside the microphone or somebody is standing beside the microphone or whether you have the microphone pointed directly at your subject uh, that projection might make a bit of a difference so yeah this is uh, the Boya BYMM1 mini microphone I think MM stands for Micro M1 because they do have another model called the M1 which is bigger than this. And this is identical to the to the almost identical to the Rode Micro. So I'm pretty sure MM stands for Micro M1 or yeah. And this is my first time having an external microphone or having another microphone. Hopefully uh being plugged into you being plugged into the camera right now hopefully changing and plugging it in while recording doesn't affect it uh, adversely or stop the stop the audio completely so hopefully you can still hear me now I'm probably going to unplug you once again There we go, now we're back to the uh, onboard microphone on the Canon SX60. Here is the uh, user's manual or some type of guide, instruction guide, instruction manual. Thank you for purchasing B Boya MM1. BYMM1. Oh my goodness. Compact size, lightweight, aluminum, will not be a heavy burden. Plug and play design, no need to worry about the battery. Comes with both cables for your smartphone or your camera. Some assembly required. 